welcome back guys to our Star Wars journey let's game part two yeah part two I believe it's part two um yeah <laughs> welcome back guys as I said in the last video I said I was going to change up some keys uh, so that I can actually evade some attacks this time um, hopefully I'm not gonna embarrass myself this episode so uh, yeah let's get to it Uh, hello. Okay, okay. So we just learned how to wall run, which is awesome. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, at least we still got it. <laughs> Think you can show me that shortcut again? Over there. Okay. Okay. Is there a way to... No. No, there's no way to put, like, a checkpoint on it. Okay. Never mind. Wait, so now I can actually... Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Nope. We gotta... Just keep going up. Now we can look at that secret... Chest. Right? Oh, okay. This area was used for meditation by someone familiar with the Jedi Order. Oh, interesting. Okay. Final. Damn, bro. Oh, wow, you floating, bro. Whoever owned this bag brought it from Coruscant. They were frustrated with the Jedi Council. Hmm. Okay. Anywhere else I can go? Always get to meditate. It's always always get to keep a calm mind, right? Yeah, screw you, you stupid frog. All right. Saber switch acquired. Cool. Good stuff. But <laughs> ah, I didn't even do that. Oh, interesting. Ok, 
Okay. Is it this way? Nope. Oh, we've been that way before. It's this way. Okay, let's go. What's in here? Oh god! Ow, ow, get the hell out of my way. Huh? Meant to scan. Meant to scan. Splox, okay. Hello, Splox. You know what? What the hell? What the hell? What the hell? Camp here. They were excited to discover a giant creature that lives close by. A binog, they called it. Binog. Oh my. I guess that's what you call a bi. Oh my god. What is that? Ooh. Okay. That man just baited me. Just bait. Did you see that? Just... Come here. Come here. <laughs> yeah. Sorry about your scop link. But standing up to that bog rat, pretty brave. Oh, oh here. Okay. So what was in there? New lightsaber sleeve. Cool, cool. What's this? What's that do? Oh, whoa, whoa! That is cool. Binoc? Huh. Oh, <laughs> interesting. A little seat to just watch it. Like a seal. Looks like a half seal. The creature seems so at home here. Half. Protector of Pagana. Something. Hmm. Lizard. I thought that was you. Looks like a dog too. Very interesting. No. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh my god, that is embarrassing. Racy there. Oh, it's on. It's on, boy. It's on, boy. We're not finished yet. Okay, okay. He probably would have won. Probably. Let's meditate. Let's meditate. Skill point available. Let's go. What can I get? Cal's maximum force is increased. Interesting. Get this one. Whoa. Oh, that is. That's cool. That is cool. All right.
Amazing. You all right, BD? Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Eno Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault, is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron, containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the force as the Zephyr once did. Okay. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, okay. Jedi. And may the force be with you. Thanks, bro. Thank you very much. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. You know, I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. No way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. Maybe we're done hiding. Hmm. Hey. You want to meet some, uh, friends of mine? Some of my friends, uh, some some friends of yours. Okay. What'd you find? Inscription. The vault is built out of carnite, a hard... Huh? Offerings. These relics contain materials that... I think I can read it. Wait, wait. I think I can read it. Data bank. Uh, uh, oh no! No no no! Oh, these ugly things. Ugh. Eh. Interesting. Interesting. There's a lot of these things I can read. 
Right. Okay. Guess I can't go this way, but the view is actually okay. There's not so much to see. Yo, that's trippy, man. I <laughs> think I found what you wanted me to see. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. Here, bro, don't mess with me. Out of my face. Um, wait, twenty eight percent explored only. There's an there's something over there. you mean here? I haven't explored something here. Interesting. Oh well. Scanning again? My friend, it appears the Sefo had some interest in death up here. It's strange for such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. Nice job. Faded mural. Faded mural located on the ground not far. A faded mural located on Bogano, not far from the Zephyl Vault. It likely represents a planet, but the artwork is too damaged to make out any specifics. Okay. Oh, hello. Uh, Should be a lot quicker than the way in. Did not explore this way yet. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Interesting, interesting. Hello there. Hello. Oh, hi there. What? Hi, what? Hi, where? Who there? Oh, yeah, these things are cute. Making a new friend. Boglings. Boglings. Boglings are small creatures endemic to Bogano. Natural escape artists, they involved. To run on their toes, this technique uh, quickly changed dark and dark. It makes them rocky and marsh like terrain. Their fury bodies compensate for the heat lost through their bare feet. Coolio. Interesting. Okay. 
Um, yeah, I can make that jump. Yeah. All right. So. Like it smells worse than grease oh does. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. That thing does a lot of damage. I think that's a lot of damage. Oh man, I gotta go all the way back. I gotta go all the way back. I think I've had enough of freaking frogs tonight. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna leave it at that. And uh, see you guys in part three. Bye bye.